Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to part 27 of Persona 4, and even though Kanji's dungeon is officially unlocked, well, here's the thing. We, um, uh, aren't going to go in there just yet. We're not going to go into the Midnight Channel just yet. I have to make some last-minute preparations. First and foremost, I wanted to actually, uh, get Ko to at least level 5 first. And I do believe I want to make the Fox at level 2 before we decide to go into the Midnight Channel. <clears throat> so, with that said, it honestly didn't matter which one we picked. Seeing as how we just got finished unlocking level 4, this is the halfway point of the social link. And you'll still get diligence regardless. And if after all the times we uh, showed up at practice, I guess it would be around this time you'd probably get at least one or two levels of diligence. But then again, when it comes down to rainy days, always go to IA if you don't have enough diligence. Because it'll raise your points up dramatically. And, uh, on your way home, it turns out that Ko has not left the area. In fact, Ko is still at school, and he's on the roof right now, so we're gonna have to go after him. Well, not technically go after him, but the cutscene will bring us to him. Oh shit, it's a murder case! Oh no, he's dead! We're gonna have to call the cop! I'm just kidding, no. He's just laying back in... Lost in thought, basically. Because I was so about to draw a chalk line. I'm sorry, when I see somebody sprawled out like that... Oh, by the way, um... Either you got some nerve or something wrong with work. Those are the only two that will work for, the, for that answer. But when I see somebody sprawled out the way he is... That right there will give me the impression that he's dead, but it looks like he's not. I mean, I've seen that look in Grand Theft Auto San Andreas and also in um, the WWE games, where they're completely sprawled out on the ground like they're dead and shit. Things like that. So that's pretty much what Ko just did. And as it turns out... Ko's family started approving of him becoming a basketball player. And now he doesn't want anything to do with it. As I stated back in part 26, or was it 25? Doesn't matter. Oh, it was 26, never mind. As I stated in part 26, Ko does not like the family that he's with, but he'll eventually reconcile with them. They're just trying to push all their values on them. And by the way, you could either do, you just need some rest, or let's just have some fun. Either one of those would be fine. <laughs> so that means now, um, the fellow athletes could go to level 6, because I think I've got just enough for to reach another social link. With that said, I'd probably worry about strength later on, but I'm going to try to at least get either strength, uh, sun, and maybe moon at a high level of um, social link before we are going on to summer break at the end of, if not my mistake, of July. That's what I remember. I, I do believe it's July that we go on a summer break. I'll try to do as much as I can to get those guys at a high rank or at max. But at the same time, I'm going to try to squeeze in the rest of the investigation team because obviously they need to have more priority over anybody else because we're taking them into the twi into the um, Midnight Channel. So, if anything, my objective was to raise him up to level 5 
And I think my other objective is to raise the fox at level 2. There is also another reason why that I um, haven't gone into Kanji's dungeon yet. And we'll be getting to that later on in the week. But talk to Nanako. You will actually uh, get a prize for getting the top score. You have to wait till you came home first, by the way. And the prize for getting the best score in the entirety of the school is a plastic medal, if I'm not mistaken. No, portrait medal, that's what it is. The plastic medal is later on. The portrait medal, that is something you want to equip to you immediately. I mean, it's an exclusive item for him anyway. Yes, definitely. Portrait Metal will actually give you plus five to all... Oh, yeah, and I forgot to put a Kevlar vest on uh, um, Yosuke. Let's see. Oh, nope, never mind. I can't do that. So everybody's at uh, level 14, so that makes grinding a hell of a lot easier. Uh, let's see. I don't have electricity, so I don't need the Stunder Vow. But I know somebody who will later on. Anyway, let's head upstairs. I do believe I have some reading to do. I'll try to at least finish the book. Sometimes you'll get distracted. And other times you won't. So let's go on ahead and go back to the uh, Timid Teacher series. At this point, it would be best to try to finish this book so that way you would get as much understanding as humanly possible. Because again, it would be around this time that the... Um, that the other jobs like origami would be unlocked but later on in the month i think the 25th the hospital and the tutoring job will be unlocked and you'll be needing understanding for tutoring and courage for the hospital job so bear that in mind so now we're gonna have to go to classroom 1f because ayabihara is waiting and that's where she will remain until you actually start her social link. Then she'll only be there for certain days. What? You'll have to walk up to ask her out to start the side quest. I mean, not the side quest, just actually... Well, you have to ask her out first, then and actually to uh, start the social link. You're going to have to come back the following day and ask her again, or whenever you get the chance to. To ask her again so let's go in the town and make sure you have level three courage before you actually ask her out if there's one thing that i am glad for the stats don't decrease so that's a good thing at least um i'll worry about that later the uh going to the tutoring not the tutoring i'm at the um daycare center. Instead, we're going to be heading over to the Fox to turn in the quest that we ended up finishing back in part 24, if I'm not mistaken. And I'm also checking the bulletin board, but it's not the 25th yet, so we still have other jobs. I'm also actually remembering what days that um the caretaker is available. That's why I'm doing this, because I'm trying to remember the days. And, uh, yeah, let's step away from the board. So let's... Wait, wait, hold on. Go back, you fool. We gotta get rank three! I mean, rank two, sorry. Yeah, yeah, that's right. We're gonna be going to get rank two first. Then we're gonna deal with Minami. I mean, it's not going to be raining tomorrow. It's a bright, sunny day. And it's only going to start raining till it's 
about the oh, start rating heavily when it's the fourth. So we're going to have to call on the Fox. You don't, again, need a persona for Hermit. So that's a good thing. All you need to do is just walk up and rank up once you finish the quest. Good news is, now that we have this at level 2, it's going to cost less to replenish our SP. Again, why in the world wasn't this at Yukiko's Castle? We could have easily grinded up the money to actually uh, heal ourselves and prepare for battle for Yukiko. But like I said, Atlas does not like grinding one bit. So with that said, we are at rank 2 and now the SP which originally would have cost 16,000 to fill up a full SP gauge, I think it just lost 10% more you just got a 10% discount, basically. That's what it is. So now we can go home and... Honestly, foxes are cute. So long as you're not trying to raise chickens, then they're bastards. <laughs> no, seriously, foxes can be bastards when it comes down to chicken raising. Whatever the case, we've got Nanako. Let's hope that we are able to actually raise a social link. Oh, I think we fucked up, so this will actually up her uh, points to where the next time we're able to get a social link with her, we'll be able to do so. Hopefully. And after spending a precious, mo precious moment with her, I think we just got three points. And, of course, we're going to be coming closer soon. I hope I don't screw this up next time, because it would be a hell of a lot of points to try to make up. I can't believe I did that last part. That was a mistake. Alright. On your way to school, however, they're going to be mentioning something about a, a TV show that will appear every Sunday. We're about, it's about time for us to actually have that TV show appear. And, uh, <clears throat> the TV show in question. is basically Tanaka's, uh, I forgot the damn name of the show. It's Tanaka's, um, Amazing, uh, Commodities. That's what it is. I can't believe I for I played this game multiple times and I forgot the TV show. Alright, we're gonna go into town and we're gonna deal with Manami first. Yeah, that's basically the preparation and, and the unlocking that I was showing off, by the way. And for the record, Kanji's dungeon will end on the 4th, so I'll do as much as I can before recklessly... Oh, wait, hold on. I thought there was something there, but apparently not. I'll do as much as I can before recklessly going into Kanji's Kanji dungeon. And then eventually, I'll go into Kanji's dungeon. But before I do, we're going to start another request. Because this one's in the neighborhood anyway. And I do believe we're going to probably have to wait till Kanji's dungeon is finished before we can even do this, do the rest of this quest anyway. So we might as well get it started. Because it'll take two days and... No, I think it's, it'll take three days. Never mind. <clears throat> or it'll take two, depending on how well things go. Like, you solve the problem and you go straight to the fox. 
and hopefully nobody else in is like available that day because you'll probably miss out on them. I mean, teeter-tottering social links is kind of hard. So accept the wish. And all we need to do is head back into the shopping district. And it would be the woman that would be standing right by the steak shop. Not you. It would be... Not you. Wait, hold on. Let's go back. I think that was the woman. Hold on. You're a kid. Go back. Um, hold on. Wait. No, 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 no. I think... Yes, that's the woman right there. Turn around, you fool. All right. And let's talk to her. We need to actually talk to her first, and then we'll have to uh, suggest her a snack. I think the third time we have to get meat gum from Chie to give to her. So that's how that uh, social link is going to end. However, it's going to take three days for, th no, how that social link rank is going to end. However, it's going to take, I think, two to three days for that to work. So, like I said, we're going to be going straight to the uh, daycare center so we can unlock the temperance social link. Which is why I went and bought some Persona in the last part. And since it's Saturday, we might as well start that right now. Because after all, I think Vishnu is the only Persona I've missed out on. And... Mahakala. No, wait, no. I actually got Mahakala. But Vishnu's the only one I missed out on. No, like, the last time I played for the first time. I don't have, like, uh... The Persona fused in this game because... The last time I played it, I forgot to finish off Death. This time, I won't forget. So on that note, we'll just stay idly by and watch the kids play at the daycare center. Now, the thing is, when you come here, you're going to get understanding from the daycare center. Something I forgot to put on the pros and cons. And I do believe that will happen in some parts of this social link. So bear that in mind. Man, that's a lot of easy it's a lot of energy to keep up with kids. And then you remember, hey, you were kids once yourself. So on this rate. After all is said and done, that one kid, Yuta, has been left behind again. And the reason is, Eri is not too used to the area of Inaba, so therefore it took her long to get home. However, that kind of drove a wedge between her and Yuta because she remarried Yuta's dad. Also, and I don't think he... No, I think he doesn't... Okay, let me put it like this. I think he doesn't think she cares about this family what bit. That's what it is. Sorry for stumbling. But... There's Mana... No, there's Eri Manami right there. So quite frankly, it is a uh, mother and son spat. Because he's not used to his new mother. I mean, I can understand when your dad or your mom gets a new person and they want you to call them dad. It's really, really confusing. So on that note, doesn't matter what you pick since this is rank one, you're still going to get rank one. Oh wait, actually it's not rank one yet. We still have to open the rank first. So it doesn't matter what you pick. And another thing about um, this rank. 
Imagine the money that you will be making doing this social link. I think this is the highest paid social link out of the entirety of the game. Oh, sorry, my chair is like, um, my back is rubbing up against the chair and it's making weird sounds. Sorry about that. I'm trying to get comfortable here because, well, ah, my back is killing me from all this staying at home. Anyway, these two have a talk to each other in six months, her husband's away, and quite frankly, Yuta has not fully accepted Eri, and that's the whole point of this quest. I would say Yuta's a good kid, it honestly doesn't matter what you pick, at the end of the day, you're gonna start this um, social link as soon as you actually... Uh, meet the requirement which is one get level three in understanding or what's it diligence level three in diligence and two it's to come here twice something i forgot to put on the cons in the uh splash card but nonetheless temperance is only available monday Thursday and Saturday, three days a week. And if you're not, if any of your social links are busy, you could always come and deal with her. Also, you require a level three understanding the suns and you start and you must visit twice. Not to mention, it's not available on rainy days. However, you'll get 10,000 yen off the bat. And you'll remaining actually you'll be getting ten thousand every time you visit after the social link is over with. So yeah, ten thousand dollars is a lot. Okay, ten thousand yen, sorry, is a lot of money in this game, cause resources is scarce and you need all the money you could get. Especially since when I go into the Midnight Channel, that also will start another social link. Which I won't have a splash card for. However, I'll probably make a dedicated part for. On that note, we're going to be headed straight to bed. I've only read The Great Man two times. I think I'm going to have to read it one more time in order for me to um, finish it off. Or I could just make myself some envelopes to gain more money. I'll just... Uh, I'll just read the book. I'm pretty sure I need to read it one more time and I'm done with it after this. Well, actually no. I gotta read it this time and one more time. So. <clears throat> with that. We have like one more day before that book is done. And unfortunately, if we're going into Kanji's dungeon, we're not going to be able to uh, read the book. Like, talking about it. But before you leave, there is one thing that must be done. Takata's amazing... Oh, Tanaka's amazing commodities. And goddamn... This guy has came a long way. As a matter of fact, he was devil in Persona 3. And before his whole commodity business had started, he was trying to scrape off the ground from the whole shopping network. Now it became so popular, you're practically buying literally off the television. And Tanaka comes back in Persona 5. So it's fantastic to see him again. Especially that catchy theme. God, I love this theme song so much. But there's a reason why I went to the um, daycare center and got a lot of money. Because of the uh, offers that this guy gives you. On one hand, he gives you the audio shoes for Chie. Which is really good considering the fact that... At the time, you didn't spend any money on Chie's equipment. That is going to have to change. 
On the other hand, you got to get medicines for a medicine kit, which will give you two medicines and a medicine kit, basically. So I would take the... Uh, I would take the shoes over the kits because the shoes, like I said, will give Chie more power in the next dungeon when when we're done here because by the time we actually finish this dungeon, no, actually by the time we get the shoes, we'll be finished with Kanji's dungeon and then when we unlock the next dungeon, well, at least she'll have some better equipment. So on that note, the song is over, and it is a catchy song, a meme-worthy song, in fact, put with a lot of uh, interesting memes, including a one Super KFC. For those of you who aren't familiar with that meme, it's the guy who's literally dancing with the KFC uh, wings, eating, like, dancing with them and eating one at a time while grooving to the music. So he practically was like photoshopped on every single musical number. Tanaka's commodity theme was one of them. But even then, Tanaka's commodity themes goes with practically everything. And let's see if I can sell something and get something better. Because I did spend at least 9,000 yen on this... Um, package. So on that note, let's see what we could do. I'll just sell those and I'll get some more stuff when we get into Yukiko's castle, so it'll be no big deal. But I'm going to get an imitation katana cuz a long sword will cost too much and it will also knock down my hit rate. I guess imitation katana will work. I mean, it's kind of messed up that this is actually the best weapon as far as evasion is concerned. Well, the golf club is the best weapon as far as evasion is concerned. And everything else just takes a hit on evasion. At least, my character will be doing more damage. But on that note, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to end it here and go straight for the save point. Because next time on Persona 4, this will be the start of going into the Midnight Channel and preparing to deal with Kanji's dungeon and doing some side quests on the side. By the way, I won't be showing off all the fights in Yukiko's castle, because after all, I've already did that several parts ago. So I'll see you guys at part 28.